Hi guys, welcome back to the shop. Today's project is going to be another pallet one project. Um, I got a couple of nice pallets from work this week. I'm going to make a nice decorative shelf for the bedrooms. I'm going to do two videos on this one, I think. Um, the first video is going to be um, using all of the tools in the workshop. The table saw, the router, the planer, the jointer. Um, and we're going to do it that way. And the second one is I'm going to do it using only a jigsaw. And I'm going to show you that you don't necessarily need to have all of the fancy tools, but it's also going to ask the question, is having, the, having all of the fancy tools worth the investment? So hopefully we should have an answer at the end of the video. So I hope you enjoy them, and I will see you guys at the end of each. Take it easy, I'll see you in a bit. So while those boards have been glue up and in the clamps now, I just want to tell you about another channel. Um, it's a friend of mine who's just started his channel. He's not a DIYer, but what he is, he's a professional drift car driver in the Irish circuit over here and he's doing some work on his M series uh, and it's him and a couple of lads from uh, the place I work in. He's having a mess around. I'm going to leave a link to the description to Charlie's channel down below. It's called The Shred Shed. It's well worth a watch, quite funny. Um, I'll leave a link down below. Hit him up, give him a subscribe and a bell for the notification, he'd really appreciate it.
Right, so that's it for this one. That's the first one that's been done. So that's the one that we used all the tools for. Um, do I like it? Not really. <laughs> I actually prefer the other one. Um, I think it's just a little bit too dark for my own personal taste. Um, but that's you know that's here and there. Um, as for the question with the woodwork and do you need all the fancy tools? Depends on the project, I guess. Um, for these kind of projects, no, you don't. You, you need basic tools. That's all you need. You can do a perfectly good job without. Having all the tools though does make life a lot easier, um, especially with pallet wood. You know, if you can put it through the plane, it'll get rid of all of that that, that top layer nice and uh, nice and quickly. So it's a lot less sanding. The jointer and putting it through the table saw will give you nice clean edges for when you're joining the boards up, so you get lovely clean edges. Um, and it does look a little bit more professional. Um, but that being said, um, the link to the to the first video is just up here, and I actually prefer the second one um, mainly because it doesn't have all the fancy edges and it's a little bit lighter as well. It's just got a Danish oil finish. Um, so yeah, personal taste I guess, it depends on the project, I mean if you're making fine furniture you need the tools, if you're just making little things like this, little hobby tops, um, no you don't, you know, just a few basic tools and you can do some great projects with it. Um, anyway, I hope you enjoyed the video, um, hopefully you'll, you'll watch the other one as well. Um, if you haven't subscribed I'd like to invite you to do so, that would be great. Um, I'd also like to thank everyone who's been watching along for the last year or so because I've just hit the 4,000 subscriber mark. For me, that's really pleasing. Um, I hope to put a bit more content out in the, in the new year. Anyway, guys, thanks very much for watching, and I will catch you guys on the next one. Take care. Bye.